Hello. In this lecture, we'll see a problem based on Lagrange's formula. A problem is apply Lagrange's formula, find x when y is equal to 6. Given the data, x values are 20, 30, 40, y values are 2, 4.4, 7.9. So very important is what here find x when y is 6 means we are going to find the value of x at y is equal to 6 means we are going to use inverse Lagrange's formula here solution solution so given the data so x naught will consider as 20 x1 will consider as 30 x2 will consider as 40 similarly y0 will consider as 2 y1 will be y1 will be 4.4 and y2 will be 7.9 so according to this one we need to find so means they have given given what here f of x is equal to 6 they have given according to this i have taken f of x is equal to 6 which implies y value is 6 and x value is what here question mark so we need to find this so f of x is equal to 6 they have given from the question and y is 6 x is question mark so by using what here lagrangius by Lagrangius inverse interpolation formula inverse interpolation formula that is the formula will be f of x is equal to the formula will be y minus y1 y minus y2 because we have only what here y0 y1 y2 x0 x1 x2 okay so divided by y0 is missing in the numerator the formula will be y0 minus y1 y0 minus y2 into x0 plus second term y minus y0 y minus y2 divided by y2 y1 is missing so y1 minus y0 y1 minus y2 into x1 next again plus next term will be y minus y0 y minus y1 divided by y2 minus y0 y2 minus y1 into x2 so x0 x1 x2 and y0 y1 y2 so we have to stop here so we have taken all so we know that the value of y is 6 then uh, we know from the data uh, y0 is 2 y1 is 4.4 y2 is 7.9 and with respect to x0 is 20 x1 is 30 x2 is 40 we'll apply here and we'll see so therefore here we are finding the value here so f of x actually x of 6 okay so which is nothing but at x is y is equal to 6 we are finding so it is nothing but y value is 6 6 minus y1 y1 value from the table it is 4.4 into y value is 6 minus y2 value from the table y2 value from the table it is 7.9 divided by y0 value so y0 minus y1 so y0 value from the table it is 2 minus 4.4 2 minus 7.9 into x1 x0 value from the table it is 20 plus next term 
y value is 6, y naught value from the table it is 2 into y value is 6, y2 value from the table, uh, sorry, uh, y2 value is 7.9 from the table divided by y1 minus y0 y1 value from the table it is 4.4 minus y0 is 2 into y1 is 4.4 minus y2 value is 7.9 into x1 value from the table it is 30 next if you continue next term this one third term will have to plus y minus y0 the y value is 6 minus y0 is 2. 6 minus y minus y1. y1 is 4.4 divided by y2 value is 7.9 minus 2. 7.9 minus 4.4 divided by x2 value from the table it is 40. So we need to simplify this all data so that we will get what here. So on simplification, so 6 minus 4.4, 4, so it will be 1.6 into 6 minus 7.9, so you will get minus 1.9 into this 20 divided by 2 minus 4.4, it will be minus 2.4 into 2 minus 7.9 it will be minus 5.9 plus this 20 already have taken here next is 6 minus 2 is 4 6 minus 7.9 will be minus 1.9 into this 30 divided by 4.4 minus 2 will be 2.4 into 4.4 minus 7.9 will be minus 3.5 into 30 already taken plus next term here 6, point, uh, 6 minus 2 is 4 then 6 minus 4.4 will be 1.6 into 40 divided by 7 Point 0.9 minus 2 will be 5.9 into 7.9 7.9 minus 4.4 will be 3.5 so if you simplify all these value so you will get the answer as 35.2462 so therefore therefore I can conclude the problem here as Therefore, thus, thus the value, thus the value of x when y is equal to 6 is 35.2462. So, in this way, we can simplify a problem of Lagrangius interpolation formula.